In the previous lesson, we made a super secret disk image with our stuff in it, and nobody can get in there without that password. So if we double click on it again, one, two, three, four, and we click OK, and it opens it up. And we close it. I'm going to right click, eject. And we can do this all day long, but this time, let's do this. Let's type in our password, and this time, let's say, remember it. Now, what does that do? Well, if we open it up and then eject it again, this is fun, isn't it? It doesn't ask that question anymore. So let's say when you first set this up, like we did in the previous lesson, you did check that thing that said, save in keychain. But now you've changed your mind. Or, here's a better one for you. What if you forgot the password? You know, I hate it when that happens. I'll tell you what, do this. Go into your hard drive and go into Applications and go down to Utilities and open up Keychain Access right there. And there is a keychain. Now, in Keychain Access on the default screen, if you come down here, you will notice there it is. Super Secret DMG. Disk Image Password. Double click on it. Now you have attributes and access control. Number one, the kind is disk image password. Don't worry about the count number, that really doesn't mean anything. Super secret DMG. Okay, you can put comments in here if you want to. Show the password. I forgot my password. Now if you click here, it's going to say, well, I'll show it to you. But what's your administrator's password? Now we haven't set that up yet, but we will, and I have one. So it's bu 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 bu. One, two, three, four. Now, I can change that if I want to and save the changes. But if we get into Access Control, you will notice that it's Allow All Applications to Access. We're confirming before access, ask for keychain, but here is the application that opens the disk image. Always allow access because that's what we told it to do. I don't want it to allow access, so I'm going to go here and click here to get rid of that. And I'm not only going to do that, I'm going to say ask for keychain password. And click save changes. Now again, it's going to ask for my administrator's password. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's close this out too, Command W. Now if we come over here and attempt to open it again, it's back to asking me if I want to use my password in here. Total control over what we do. If you forget a password, I have done that before. And it's like I've got to have this password. It's accessing maybe one of my client's accounts that I'm working on, like a website. And I say, oh man, I forgot that. Well, I can go into Keychain Access, and all I would have to do then is go in there, put in my admin password, and I can find those passwords. So you can change your mind. You can make it secure if it isn't. Or as we did, we added the security back into it. Keychain Access.